be spending the next 100 days in GTA 5, but everything is realistic. From needing to get a real job in order to generate money, and even having to watch my speed so I don't get pulled over. Oh, great. Yeah, this is actually gonna be like, pretty pretty difficult honestly and I have just one goal to buy the golf course you might be wondering why the golf course and I'll tell you when I first beat this game as a kid I had just enough money to buy everything but the golf course I plan to rectify my childhood trauma at any cost over the next 100 days and I'll need to start all the way on day one well, hello. As you can see, I am outside of a KFC on day one with literally nothing. And I mean, like, I literally don't have any clothes even. <laughs> My first goal is to get a job. So there are multiple jobs surrounded around the map, some legal and others not legal. But I'm going to need to go fast because I'm a long way from my $150 million golf course. That's going to be my house if I don't start working. I got a job as a pizza delivery driver. For the most part, the day was pretty good. Gave some people some pizza on time, and I made enough for my first big purchase. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get ourselves a white tank top. $18? All right. Unfortunately, I only really made enough money for that shirt, so I, I don't really have enough to get an apartment or, or really anything at this point. So I guess this is my home for the night. I'll see you guys tomorrow. On day two, I woke up and I saw this guy who looked a lot like me right now. Hey, Hello, good sir. The dawn of the clouds is coming. All right. However, I called a cab to take me somewhere special, to take me somewhere that would change my life. School. Nothing like paying $1 million a year for something that I can learn on YouTube. Nonetheless, this is realistic GTA 5, so it makes sense. Okay, let's see how much these classes are. I'm hoping it's nothing too much. Because I'm going to have to, okay, $1,000 for this course. That's actually not too bad, considering how much classes really are in real life. I wanted to stop at a local 24-7 to hopefully get some food, but I ended up meeting a really interesting man. Hey, do you think I could get some gum, please? No can do. My evil twin brother took all the gum. But you should subscribe right now so you don't miss any new content. Well, that is not what I was expecting. I decided to do the one job that actually was giving me money at the time, which was my pizza delivery boy driver. <laughs> Day after day, I started to make at least least a little bit of money. Here's your pizza, sir. Hot and fresh. Hot and fresh. Hot and fresh. Oh. On day six, I met Jesus. Not the real one, but this guy. Jesus, I'm gonna need some advice. I'm getting done with these pizza, my man. And then something came over me. Something not so pleasant. It was greed when I saw the nice car go past me. But hey, I didn't let that bother me because I want to do things the right way, the ethical way, the proper way. So on day 10, I picked up a new job at a repo service for a man named Simeon. The only problem is it requires a car. And as you can see, I can't afford any car at all with $212. So I tried getting a job at a construction site, but they were not hiring. Kept looking around for jobs, but on day 12, I had a genius idea. I would use the scooter for my pizza delivery job to get the repo job done. This is an airtight plan, ladies and gentlemen. I have nothing but confidence that this is going to work out for myself. Okay, the car is up here. I'm just gonna have to get in front of it. And I think as soon as I get in front of it, I can just get it and get my money. All right, sir, please stop there. Nope. Sir. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I forgot that the scooter didn't spawn. Sir, please come back. Sir, please. Oh. Okay, um, I'm not a criminal yet because he's letting me borrow the bike, right? Maybe not from that reaction. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna borrow this bike. We're gonna get this repo position done. In that same day, I untied a man on a post, and I gave what was clearly a very intoxicated couple a ride to a hotel. Oh. We well, I guess I'm leaving my bike behind. Here. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. I like the best. There you go, guys. We've got a little unfinished business to attend Well, to. that's gross. All right. Well, now I am stranded in the middle of nowhere with no real money and no car. This is a great start. I called the cab to take me back to the city and I did what I'm best at at this point, pizza delivery. Hot and fresh, hot and fresh, hot and fresh, hot and fresh, hot and fresh. I'm done with pizzas. But after a full day of grinding away at my in-game nine to five, I did it. I made enough money for a class and it was a driving course. Let's get it. Let's do this! Okay, it says drive around for two in-game hours and don't crash or else you won't pass. That time it was not my fault. Okay, this guy just clearly- No, why are you honking at for? I don't think I'm passing, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think I'm passing. I just passed! I can't believe it. I actually can't I won't lie. It. This achievement felt really good to me. Have you ever worked on something so hard and you couldn't wait to tell someone? Well, this is literally how I felt at this moment, except I didn't have anybody to tell it to, so. 
Nonetheless, that golf course does feel like it's actually obtainable at this point, but I'm gonna have to keep working. On day 14, I decided to take my cab and my new license and actually use it to make some money. Come on in, sir. Welcome to Jano's cab. Okay, calm down, mister. We'll get you there fast as possible. Let's go. I think I just... Oh, no. Great. Absolutely great. I got pulled over, ladies and gentlemen. I got pulled over. All right, sir, here you are. Have a good day. You were trash. I... Okay. I wish I could tell you that things got better for my cab job, but... I did not run a red light. That one to me. I never evaded the police. It's been seized? Next Wait a minute, that doesn't mean... That doesn't mean that they took away my... No, 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 no. They just took away my license. It's not there anymore. Fuck nuts. No, no. Stupid cab! Are you recording this? Hey! Oh, hello. Yeah, it's uh, it's day 20. Unfortunately, that video that the person took of me, um, it went viral. So now no jobs will hire me. I have no choice but to call a man named Z. Now, a brief history of Z. He's uh, he's not a good guy. He has connections with selling stuff. Not good stuff. It's, it's drugs. He sells drugs. I decided to steal a car, officially sealing my fate as a criminal. Well, I guess this is the individual I am now. No going I back. met up with some bad men, picked up some supplies, and I headed out. From there. Is this, this how this transaction usually works? Just in front of this? Okay. Alright. See you guys later. Have a good day. The next day, I went to the stash house. This is where anything I purchase goes, so I can stash it here or I can sell it. Is it legal? No. Is it realistic? Unfortunately, yes. It, it is realistic. <laughs> the day after that, I decided to sell all of that bad stuff, and I'll be honest, I finally started to see some money come in. On day 25, I even got close to the bad men that I saw previously. They're actually pretty nice guys. Their names are Pablo and Esteban. Pablo Esteban, hello! In the coming days, I was getting really good at selling this stuff. Was making some serious money. Until... Oh my goodness, they're shooting at me! I should've known! I should've known this was the wrong block to sell on! This was the wrong block to sell on! Oh my god! Oh my gosh, excuse me! I'm so sorry! Oh my gosh! If you play bad, expect bad things to happen. So, I ditched my car in a basketball court, and I knew I needed to do something. Something important, because if I was going to get that golf course, something needed to change. On day 40, I needed a new look. But most importantly, I needed... I better not see a single comment about you making fun of my pink gun. I decided to get some protection, so I joined a family. It was a gang. <laughs> Which, hey, again, very realistic. So let me introduce you to the hood life. Police in South LA are looking for more suspects in a raid on an auto parts store. Do Notify call three. All officers stay down. Shots are being fired from AK-47. You can see they are opening fire right now. I won't lie, this family was pretty cool. They also had some stuff for me to sell. Again, not so good stuff. Here you are, ma'am. Enjoy your stuff. And, sir, why are you in the bushes? <laughs> you must really not want someone to know you're buying this stuff. Just by selling this stuff for the last couple of days, I have made more money than I have ever seen so far. But on that same day, things took a turn. Hey. Help, help, I got you. I got you. Wallet. Sir. Please. Sir, please. Me. Just stop it, man. Okay, I don't. Do I want to shoot him? Okay, I haven't. All right, whatever. Okay, I think I can get. Oh my gosh, sir! I don't want to hurt you. Please, sir. Go behind the tree. Behind the tree. Oh my gosh, I think I could probably. I just want to get the money. I just want to get the money. That's all I want. I don't want to kill him. He's still shooting. Okay, I'm gonna get this money here. All right, I'm out of here now. I'm. Oh my gosh, I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. Where is he? Oh my gosh, I think he's still hunting me. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. I don't want to do this. Please, sir. Oh, shit. Ugh. Oh my god, I just killed him. See, I knew the consequences of doing bad things. I mean, I got the gun for a reason. But something about that man on the ground because of me was very off-putting in the moment. To selfishly make myself feel better, I gave the guy don't back his wallet. My karma, but there you go. Oh my god, man. You're awesome! Am I, though? Am I? 
I was lost. I turned to a local man in the area for some advice. You were the chosen one. It was said that you would destroy the Sith, not join them. Okay, did you just quote Star Wars? Kyle, that is no help at all right now. Subscribe for- Unfortunately, quickly after that, my family gang was under attack. Get out of here, crazies! I'm gonna survive this. I don't think I'm gonna survive this. Yeah, get going! Get going! Get out of here! It's family turf! Yeah, they're running away, y'all! They're running away! Uh-oh. Hey, yo, it's the police! It's the police, guys! Let's go! Let's go! We out of here! We out of here! It's family turf! At that moment, I knew I could no longer be part of this family, because it was just too dangerous. Alright guys, it's, uh, it's day 60. I left the gang about a week ago. Um, I am so far away from my $150 million dream golf course. I'm going to literally have to grind as hard as I possibly can if I'm going to get that golf course. I decided to dump all of my savings into a bike. A bike that would soon become famous. Good evening. The LAPD says to be aware of your surroundings and to now be careful if you're wearing expensive jewelry out in public. At this moment in time, we are unable to identify the individual who is responsible for all of these mass robberies. We will, however, say if you have any friends or family in the LA area, this individual seems to be armed and has been known for wearing a pig's mask. They are calling him the mass pig robber, and he is still yet to be captured. Police have still been keeping this investigation open. We will update you with more news as soon as we can. I saw him. I saw him with my own eyes. He went into the 24-7 store, and he shot the clerk. I saw him do what I saw him do. He needs to be captured. He is a menace. It seems the police have finally trapped the mass pig robber outside of a local police bank. Yeah, we got a visual on the suspect. He's currently on foot shooting with an AK-47. We got visual on the suspect. He is currently on a jet ski going southbound. 10-4. We still don't have an identification for this person. However, we do know this. He is dangerous. Money was no longer a chore to get, but rather something I had, and I had a lot of. I did it. I purchased the golf course. Now the big question is, would the young version of me be happy? Heck yeah he would, I just got a golf course. I mean that, that is awesome. <laughs>